great cause. And ladies and gentlemen, PNC Broadway production of in Louisville of Pippin is here. And according to the New York Times, it is astonishing. She looks astonishing. <laughs> Sabrina Harper is with us. Welcome to Louisville, Sabrina. Thank you very much. I'm happy to be here. Before we talk about the details of the place, mm -hmm. last night, the debut of Pippin, opening night. So your thoughts, what do you oh, think? It was amazing. I mean, it was a, a wonderful audience. Um, we were really just embraced. Everybody laughed, loved it. They had a good time, uh, full house. And we were a little bit nervous. You know, Taylor Swift was down, down the road. So we saw all these crowds coming in thinking, oh, are they coming for us? And then we realized, ooh, she's in town. Okay, well, but that curtain came down and, and we had a full house and just a wonderful audience. So we're happy to be here. I think people here in Louisville love the arts. They love the theater. What did you think of the venue? I always want to get you know your review from, from a performer's viewpoint. What, what did you think of the Kentucky Center for the Oh, Arts? it's beautiful. I mean, when I walked, let alone the backstage area, I walked in in those dressing rooms. I thought, ooh, this is nice. That was the first thing I said when I walked in. <laughs> well, I'll never see those dressing rooms. Yeah, that's, that's for never the, the big stars. Never <laughs> Well, I, I'm really happy to have you in town for a number of reasons. First of all, Pippin. Let's talk about the, the show a little bit. Yes. Um, elaborate sets, very bold, acting, singing, acrobatics. It really has it all. For someone who really loves live theater, this is a great show. Well, we've taken, definitely, Pippin has brought a new di dimension to the theater. Um, we've not only, you know, your typical musical theater, you're going to have singing, dancing, and acting, but we've added that fourth element of acrobatics. So you're kind of getting, you know, if, if people love Cirque du Soleil and you love musical theater, we've morphed that together and created that with a deep story about finding your purpose in life or young man's journey. So it's really just, um, we've got it all. And it is colorful and it's it's um, a beautiful production. You know, as much as I love the new school changes, and you can see them here on the screen, Bob Fosse, this is a classic. I hope there's still some of that Bob Fosse influence. Oh, very much, very much. Um, we do have original choreography from the 70s version, original choreography from Bob Fosse, and Chet Walker, who choreographed um, the dance aspect of this revival, um, was a Fosse dancer and has taken part what Fosse has created and brought in, oh, there's me, <laughs> and brought it into, um, you know, this production. So there's a lot of Fosse still there. And also, let alone the story and, and the darkness that Fosse, in, you know, involved in this production, it's still there. It's, you know, with the idea of uh, back then Ben Vereen played it. Um, you know, I think it can still, sometimes that show is a bit darker, so we've lightened it up a little bit. Um, but at the same time, it's it's all his, you know, his spirit is still with us. So. Well, last night I had to speak at a graduation, and they, and they really kind of tie in, because this is a story of Pippin, mm -hmm. who's making some life decisions, yes. which way he's going to go in life. Yeah. Um, would you recommend this for everyone in the family? Yes, I would. I would. I, re I would recommend this for um, every generation, um, c especially coming out of high school, graduating high school, graduating college, turning 60, turning 70. Sure. We are always focused with the idea of what's next, what is fulfilling. Are we fulfilled in our lives right now? You know, you, you go home and are you happy with what you have? It's, it's always that kind of feeling and, and embracing life and um, embracing what you have and continuing to, to search for the younger generation keep going searching for what makes you happy so, Sabrina Harper your, your character is very cunning yes she's very money hungry <laughs> she, she gets what she wants nothing like you though right no okay. no <laughs> but she's also just an ordinary housewife and mother, you know? She just wants the best for her son. <laughs> Folks, she's a queen, okay? Uh, no, this, this is a fabulous play. Welcome Thank to Louisville. Now, you mentioned you want to see some horses. I do. So, Matt Porter has promised to take you to Churchill Downs. I hope so, yeah. All right. Uh, we'll get together on an exacto bat together, maybe. Please, we can some yes. Okay. <laughs> well, once again, Pippin is in town, and it is astonishing. It is a play for you. It is a play for the entire family. KentuckyCenter.org. And we encourage you to give them a call. There's the number, 584-7777. Tickets still available. It will sell out. If you've been wanting to go to a Broadway play, this is the consummate Broadway play. Make it to the Kentucky Center for the Arts. All right, coming up. Want to play?